What's up YouTube, Cromwellian here, and today I've got a Project Zomboid Challenge Run series for you, specifically the CDDA Challenge. In case you don't know, the CDDA Challenge is often regarded as one of the hardest starts by PZ players, and the scenario basically goes like this. You start the game with no clothes, drunk out your mind, infected with a flu, bleeding because a glass shard's lodged into your groin, and to top it all off, your house is on fire, and every zombie in town wants to eat your face. As you're about to see, my first few characters were less than successful, but as you're about to see, on my fourth try, I was going to create a character that went the distance. Let's get into the video. Clay Stewart, I like that. I like this guy. Clay Stewart. Oh, Jesus. Dish towel. Oh, food. Okay. Better than nothing. Remove glass. Don't burn to death. Okay. Alright, we're out. We're out of the building, but we're bleeding. Uh, sneakers. Sneakers. Rip the shirt. Wrap the wound. Oh, shit. Okay, wound is wrapped. I am now, at the very least, not bleeding to death. Oh! Didn't burn to death somehow. Oh, holy crap. Oh, KM Pudge, thank you very much for the raid. I appreciate that. How's it going, guys? Hey, thanks a lot. Oh, he scratched my neck. He scratched my neck. Ah, oh, ah, oh, oh no, oh no. Oh. Where? Yeah, how's it going, guys? Okay, okay, I have clothes. I have clothes. Yes. Yes. Yeah, they can hear me. Can't use. Oh. This is it. This is it. Stop, we just fucking turbo loot and we fight. Oh, oh no, oh no, ah, oh. me out. Open the window, open the window, climb, go. Yeah, okay. Uh, uh, rip the clothing, wrap up my dick quickly, quickly, quickly. No longer bleeding, okay. Uh, he's burning. Oh, loud, he's burning. And my feeties are gonna get all cut up if I don't get some shoes soon. Need shoes. Bad. Need shoes. Need shoes. It's good. This is good. I've got a can opener. I've never gotten this far before. <laughs> Oh shit! No! No! Clean the burn. Oh Jesus. Oh my god, are you kidding? All that and I burnt my sodding leg. Oh look at him. Bring it. Uh, he does have nice arms. Right? Angelo Wong. Cool name, let's go. That's why you need shoes. Oh my god. Come on. Ugh. Need shoes. 
funsies. Uh, is there any point in having a sneaky character when you're just bloody... When you're just sneezing all the time? I'm the cook. be a strong, independent woman. Ugh. Oh, nothing. Although... Ah, okay. Immediately start with a opener. That's good. Remove the thingy. Sneakers, rip the socks, wear that, wear that, bandage de groin, you, that is going to keep me from being, getting too, bleh, getting too cold, come on in, okay, that's the worst of it done, ah! oh, I've got a good feeling about this one, Hell yeah, look at that. Alright. I don't know what the point of sneaking is when I keep sneezing. If I walk over him, surely I'm gonna get something. Oh, fuck! Get the hell out of here! Oh, are you kidding me? Such a good start. Take that. Thank you. Beeline to the thing. It, it might be worth just hunkering down, even if I run out of food. Get a little bit hungry, but just see if I can get the worst of this flu to my character. Once I'm not alerting the whole neighborhood every two seconds, I reckon I can just win the game after that. Ah, I can't believe I set myself on fire. That's so stupid. I've got a good feeling. I've got a good feeling about this one. If I can survive the first night, that'll be good. Pipe. That's pretty good. Hammer. That's even better. And I think. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to get any sneak attacks off of this cough. So we're going to go loud and proud. I'm just gonna have to bloody sit here all night, aren't I? Ridiculously tired. You gotta let me sleep through. <gasps> I can sleep. Boom. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, what? <laughs> I didn't see this room, and there were painkillers in it. Mother. Meh. Alright. Disinfect my uh, manky groin. Oh, this is a nice little place. Shovel. Uh, kettle. Can fill that with water. All right. Here comes a zombie. This side, it sounds like. Both sides. Both sides. Typical. In fact, no, what am I doing? Shit. Oh. But we have the shovel. Shovel night time. Let's go, bitch. Boom. Boom. Uh, 
just on the ground. <laughs> Alright, I can now fight medium sized fighters. So that's good. Okay, this has actually gone okay. This has gone okay. Pop some pills. Minor pain. Sleepies. Well, it's light enough to go check out that barn at the very least. Nothing of use. doesn't get me. Alright, they're near me. Pencil. Better than nothing. Oh, I didn't check that crate, did I? Nothing in it. Of course there's nothing in it. There's no loot. Well, at least this game type actually makes you feel like you're in the apocalypse. Look at that. What is that? 30 feet? I'm hearing my sneezing. Get out of here. Quite <laughs> and we just slowly and patiently pick our way into town without ever biting off more than we can chew. He heard me from over there. Ridiculous. Oh, look, there's two more. You dare. Uh, okay, alright. Now we, like I say, we don't bite off more than we can chew. Now do we take a four hour sleep? Minor pain, sleep. again. Tents. Holy shit. Tents. That could be very useful. <laughs> Alright. Three more. Three more. Come back to this place. One more day without food. One more day without food. It's a pretty bad pain now. Okay, what don't we need? I think I need uh, to just fight this time. Still have a very nasty cold. Has it been three days now? Okay, there's a house. Still got more of these assholes to take care of. There's a light at the end of the tunnel if there's any food in that house. Yeah, uh, I think it's time to pop another painkiller. Oh, and now I'm starving. Now I am starving. Okay. Pain, go away. Got to be a bit more crazy. We're gonna just walk in here. We're gonna get some food. 
and I don't care who starts, we're going to be zoomed in. No, come on, food. Yes. In. Yes, they are in. Alright. Alright, we're back up to just very hungry. Okay, am I starving still? I'm no longer starving. Uh, I travel west and do one more house. I don't know how long I've got till I start starving again. I take some vitamins and we're going to see what mischief we can get up to. Got to take risks. Got to take risks. Be something good, be something good. It's another bread knife. <laughs> Three more. Four more. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. It's home time. It is home time. <laughs> Getting closer and closer every time. Oh, Eleanor Purdy, look at you go. Put up ten. Still got a horrible cold. How long can this possibly last? Fighting out the very least. And I'm starving again. Shit. And if I'm starving, I've just got to go hard. Oh my god. Please tell me that's a machete. Fucking machete, boy! in that direction. I think I should hit up the trailer park. <laughs> Getting a tad weepy. Probably from drinking dog food. So if I follow the track to the next intersection and turn left, that will take me to a trailer park. And then there's an isolated forest house. Ooh, that looks like a better first bet. question is, are there a million zombies along this path I'm going to have to pick a way at? I said I was going to go, but <laughs> I don't think I am. Kind of attached to this now. I've never gotten this far. She is going to survive. She's not starving yet. She's full of dog food. <laughs> and it'll make me happy after eating the dog food. Matches, start fires, beer can, yeah, drink it all. I mean, probably not going to be drinking all this beer, but I need calories. Okay. Is a gun worth it right now? gonna make me sad but that is some crazy calories that I need stuffed absolutely brilliant <gasps> holy shit the cold's gone 
Okay. Did it. Got rid of the cold. Thanks for watching, Tr chat. Uh, I appreciate it. Uh, see you next time. If you got this far, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, please consider subscribing or letting me know in the comments what you'd like to see more of. Also, you can use the links provided to check out one of my previous videos or have a look at my Twitch. Thank you once again, and you have a great day.